Hi, I'm Susie Nelson Crowley. I am the founder of the Tampa Diggs team at Coastal Properties Group International, an affiliate of Christie's International Real Estate. And today we're going to talk about the top reasons we love Davis Islands. So let's go ahead and dig in. So full disclosure here, Dan and I moved to Davis Islands 12 years ago. We did a thorough review of the communities. We were looking for walkability, proximity to activities, um, just kind of a neat community environment and it had to be maintenance free. And we chose our little slice of heaven, our 1450 square foot townhome here on Davis Island and we have loved it ever since. So let's get started. Number one, the first reason we love Davis Island is its history. Davis Island was actually dredged in the early 1920s real estate boom and D.P. Davis purchased the three islands at the time that uh, consist or that made up Davis Island for a whopping $350,000. And on these islands he planned a pool, a golf course, a hotel, an airport, an airport and of course housing. He made a good investment because he sold all of those lots for $1.6 million. Sadly, Mr. Davis met an untimely end when he was lost at sea in a transatlantic crossing in 1928. So number two, the second reason that we love Davis Island is the village. There is about a two block village on East Davis that we all embrace. It has restaurants, it's got a bank, dry cleaners, two gas stations, two well-equipped um, uh, convenience stores, and really almost a United Nations worth of restaurants. We've got Greek and Italian and Mexican and Middle Eastern and Thai. Uh, we've got coffee houses and uh, restaurants that cater to the cafe crowd. It's really a great place. You'll see neighbors there meeting for dinner. They'll drive on their golf carts and wave along the way. So it's a very community oriented area. Now, the third reason that we love Davis Island are the wealth of public amenities that are here. And most of these are free or available at a very nominal cost because most of them are run by the city of Tampa. So starting out with Roy Jenkins Pool, this was built in the 1920, uh, 1928, so it's got some beautiful Art Deco architecture. It is open year round now. It's got lap swim, open swim, and lessons. Very close to Roy Jenkins Pool is the Sandra Friedman Tennis Center. There are eight hard true or, or soft courts there as well as a locker room and a clubhouse. Just to hop down the street you'll find Marjorie Park Yacht Basin. This is also operated by the City of Tampa. They offer 32 monthly and 19 transient slips as well as fuel service and showers. Now if you're trailering a boat, you're going to head to the south end of the island where there's a very uh, popular public boat ramp as well as a soft ramp for your kayaks and paddle boards. Another popular amenity on uh, Davis Island are the dog parks and there are two, one of which is even waterfront. If you've got a little slugger in the family, Bayshore Little League has a Little League field on the island so take your, um, take your lounge chair and root for the team of your choice. One of my favorite things about Davis Island is just the roads. They are perfect for cycling. They're wide, not a chance of getting doored on Davis Island. Who wouldn't want to ride here? With the parks and the waterfront and the beautiful homes, it's a great backdrop. Now number four is that Davis Island has maintained a small town feel and yet it's five minutes from downtown, five minutes from Sparkman War and Bayshore Boulevard. And so Davis Islands is this little teardrop of an island off of downtown. There is one way on and one way off. And when you get onto the island, you just kind of feel this sense of relief. There are no stoplights on the island. We are also a golf cart community, so you'll wave at your neighbors as you take a quick trip downtown to pick up dinner. Davis Island also is a very active civic community that has many uh, community events throughout the year. One of the favorites is the Toy Drive, the first weekend in December. Now, the fifth reason that we love Davis Island is that Davis Island's for the birds. We are actually 
a fly-in community. Peter O. Knight at the south end of the island is operated by the Hillsborough County Aviation Authority. You can rent, uh, rent a plane, store your plane, take a helicopter trip, even learn to fly all through Peter O. Knight. And Peter O. Knight actually has an interesting history of its own. It was um, built as part of the WPA project and served as Tampa's main airport from 1935 to 1945. Due to its proximity to downtown, Peter O'Knight still is a very busy general aviation operation today. The sixth reason that we love Davis Island is the fact that we have world-class health care here. Should you or someone you love need health care, Tampa General is just moments away. Licensed for over a thousand beds and four medical helicopters, Tampa General actually serves as a level one trauma center for 23 surrounding communities. Tampa General is also frequently mentioned in US News and World Reports, top 50 hospitals for many of its medical specialties. And Tampa General also has a wonderful affiliation with USF Health Morsani College of Medicine and serves as one of the training facilities. The seventh reason that we love Davis Island is the housing here. We have a great variation of housing from the quaint to the grand. Uh, we really run the gamut from modest apartments to a sprinkling of condos to gracious 1920s Mediterranean revival homes that have stood the test of time to those really appealing mid-century modern homes that just scream I love Lucy to luxury waterfront homes. There's something really for everyone here, but the price is not the lowest in town. Due to the unique and quaint community here, due to our proximity to downtown, Davis Islands has some of the highest uh, property values in Tampa. Davis Islands is a community that embraces its residents. There are first time homes, move up homes, and also homes where you can downsize and remain in the community that you know and love. Heck, there's even Hudson Manor, an assisted living facility. Dan says we're going to love living there. Now, the eighth reason that we love Davis Islands are some of the residents. We have some very auspicious residents. Sport figures from the Lightning, from baseball, and even Tom Brady is renting a home on Davis Islands right now. So we hope to have some positive Tom Brady and Giselle Bündchen um, sightings this fall and winter. So these are the top eight reasons that we love Davis Islands. I think you'll love it too. If you liked this video, please subscribe. There are other videos in this series that you may wish to watch. And I am still Susie Nelson Crowley, the founder of the Tampa Diggs team of Coastal Properties Group International. Thanks for spending your time with me today.